Once you're comfortable enough flying in easy mode, you can experiment with the two other flight modes on your controller. Easy mode's all the way up. Intermediate mode is in the middle position. This will allow your quad to do flips and rolls, but it'll still return to a level position. Advanced mode is the switch all the way down. This will turn off all the self-leveling features on your quad, and it'll be flying in acro or rate mode. Be really careful with this mode, it's going to turn a lot faster than it did before. I personally like to fly my small quads in easy mode. I don't know why, but for some reason it's just a lot simpler. I only use intermediate and advanced modes on these smaller quads when I want to do acrobatic moves, flips and rolls. And let's face it, everybody's going to want to try to do this at least once. I recommend trying it in intermediate mode first. Thank you for watching. This wraps up our tutorial videos on FPV 101. I hope you found all the videos useful for yourself as a beginner pilot. I know when I've watched a lot of pro pilots on YouTube, I see them flying and doing all these amazing tricks. And it can be discouraging. That guy's like so good, how am I ever going to be as good as that? I practice every day and I can still barely do a front flip without crashing. Don't get discouraged. Professional pilots fly every day, 20, 30 packs a day. They go out and race, they train, they do tricks nonstop, and they have a lot of drones to burn through. So just have fun, use your environment, fly around things that you think are interesting, and find new obstacles and challenges every day. And you'll find yourself progressing and your skill will build the more that you're having fun. And really that's, that's the key to all of it. So get your Fat Shark 101 training quad out there and tear it up.